Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to a brand new video. Today we got a creepy pasta story that apparently you shouldn't read. It's called the paragraph. I I got it right here because you know it's not like a long story, but it's too much for me to memorize. So I got it right here. Gonna read it, but uh, yeah, apparently you're not supposed to read it. And, uh, yeah, you know, I used my, uh, pendulum to talk to Courtney and Tink. Well, I talked to Courtney, really. Tink, uh, I don't know what Tink was doing. I mainly just talked to Courtney. But, uh, yeah, Courtney, you know, I asked about this. Courtney said she does know what it is and I should not read it. She did say I can't die from reading this, but she said that, you know, I probably shouldn't read this. But uh, I'm going to read it anyway. Courtney, I'm sorry, but uh, yeah. Hopefully this all goes well. But the paragraph is a scary, creepy pasta story about something you must not read. So, uh, like I said, I got it right here. So we're just going to start. It's not long, you know. Um, yeah. Hopefully nothing bad happens. So you must trust me. I have... What was that? <laughs> you must trust me. I have one piece of advice. You must follow it without question. You must stop reading this story and go straight to the last paragraph. Do so without reading any other paragraphs and do it now. Please trust me on this. Okay. It's telling me to skip to the last paragraph, but uh, we're not going to do that. Whatever happens now is entirely your fault. You failed to heed my warning, and now you're in danger. I didn't write this. They made me write it. Whatever happens, do not look away from these words. Keep reading until I tell you otherwise. I'm hearing stuff in the background. <laughs> and when I tell you otherwise... Do exactly as I say, because if you do not read this story exactly as I tell you to, you will die. Courtney told me I wouldn't. Uh, I'm sure it's fine. So listen carefully. First, you must skip the paragraph that follows this. One, whatever you do, you must never read the paragraph Following this one, you must ignore it completely, casting your eyes down the paragraph that follows it. Promise me. <laughs> Promise me you will do, do this. God. I'm trying to... It said don't look away from the words, so I'm trying to keep my eye on the words. Why there's stuff happening around me. I'm hearing stuff. And I don't like it. <laughs> you must ignore it completely, casting your eyes down to the paragraph that follows it. Promise me you will do this for the sake of all those you hold dear. This is your only chance to make up for your mistake of not trusting me earlier. Skip the paragraph following this one and do so now. We're gonna not skip. You had to do it, didn't you? You had to continue reading despite my warnings. Curiosity got the better of you. Well, they knew it would. Nothing you do now will make any difference. If you if there are people you love, call them and say goodbye. What? Tell them whatever people tell their loved ones when they know they're about to die. Settle any old scores, make your final arrangements. For from this moment on, you will stay alive only as long as you can stay awake. The next time you fall asleep will be your last. <clears throat> They're watching you. 
They're listening to your thoughts. They'll wait until you fall asleep and then they'll come for you. I'm sorry. You should have trusted me. If you skip the paragraph above, you've done well. But your troubles are not over. By placing your trust in me the second time, I asked you have given yourself a chance to live. Oh, I got a headache. I just got like a headache just now. This is what you need to know. They're watching you. They're listening to your thoughts. They're waiting for you to make a mistake. When you, when you do, they'll come for you. To stay alive, you must draw blood today, tomorrow, and every day. You must draw blood from someone you love. A drop, that's all, and place it on your tongue. Ew. That's what they want. That's what they need. They're inside you right now. And they're waiting. If between waking up and falling asleep. You fail to deliver the blood of a loved one. You will never wake up again. Follow this advice and never, never go back. And read the previous paragraph. Trust me. If you followed my advice in the par in the first paragraph, well done. You can stop reading now. But never, never be tempted to come back and read the paragraphs you skipped. You must trust me. And please, wish me luck. I'm tired. So tired. You just can't imagine. the fuck did I just read? I don't know. But yeah, like, in the, ah, God, I have a headache now. It's not like a bad headache. It's just like, do you guys know when you like, it's just that feeling when you can feel a headache going on, but you don't actually have a headache yet, but you feel it coming. That's what I feel right now. But uh, yeah, this was, um, I don't know what to say about this. Apparently, I wasn't supposed to read it, and I might die if I don't put blood on my tongue or something. I don't know. But, oh, God, this was so weird. Um, yeah. I guess that's the end of the video. Um, yeah, I wasn't supposed to read this. If I don't make another video and you never hear from me again, then I probably died. But, uh, I mean... It's, it's on the website, Scary for Kids. So I don't, I don't know. I have no clue. But yeah, if I don't make another video ever again, then I'm probably dead. Well, I will be dead. But uh, yeah, that's it, guys. Um, Yeah. Apparently, I wasn't supposed to read this, but I did. So, uh, <laughs> you know, I think everything will be fine, though. I just, it's a weird story. Like, the fact that you're supposed to take blood from your loved ones and put a drop on your tongue, that's disgusting. I'm definitely not doing that. I'd rather die than do that, even though I really don't want to die, because, you know, my life's not... I mean, my life's not great, but it's not terrible, you know? I'm having a good time living. It's pretty dope. But anyway, guys, if you like this video, hit that like button as hard as you possibly can. Subscribe while you're at it. You might as well. You're already here, and I uh, am. Yeah. Wish me luck. Um, then I don't die. Anyway, guys, I got, I got a couple more urban legends or, you know, stories that I'm not supposed to read. <laughs> if you want me to read those, let me know. I will. Um, I have read Tomino's Hell before. Um, if y'all know what that is. I didn't read it on camera. I should have read it on camera. Dang. 
Well, I'm not reading it again. Um. Anyway, guys, uh, I'm just rambling at this point. I'll see you guys in another spooky video. I'm gone, man.